Hi, Baby Risky. Good morning, Mao. Please, my son will come with you. Please help my son. Oh. My son, drop here. Yeah, draw you for your hand, you. Oh. Please, oh, God will bless you, my mama. Long life and prosperity, you. Oh. God will bless you. Oh. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, it's Lord Custard. Ha. Any other custard is a counterfeit. I'm telling you, Custard, I'm telling you, I am your Lord. What is this here? What do we have here? This is Bob Risk. My goodness, she's so beautiful. She's sparkly. I'm so happy to have Mama in my body. And she'll forever be my part. Like, she'll forever be in my body. That's gonna move her. Oh my goodness, I can't wait to see Mama. Like, I can't wait. <laughs> <laughs> poverty now bastard i swear poverty they let some people lost it that sense of reasoning mom why are you doing this to your son imagine this mother referring to bob whiskey as ma ma my son is my um, good morning ma my son is coming to your place so please help my son no oh. and my son got your face on his hand oh, please help my son imagine what a shame mother where is your senses but the poverty never reached that extent now you're still okay like seriously you are proud of what your son did to the extent that you came to social media to come and plead that Bob Risky should help your son with cash like he used to help, right? Hey, now wow, hey, what is what what is wrong with some people? Like, hey, girl, mommy, like yeah, At first, your face, your people, your your son face draw tattoo. Not even your own image, or neither did that. Or his own picture, his own face, Bob Risky face, and you are proud of that, madam. Why? Why are you mis? Why are you misleading our youth? Why are you misleading your child? Why? Encouraging him to go and meet Bob Risky to help him. Mom, it's not up to this. Like seriously, eh? I trust my mother. They're not even born you well. Ibolo fegbewo. If what you learn, you talk about how far by you go somersault like <laughs> times ten before you get yourself, madam. Like seriously, if you don't see anybody follow you talk, this thing where you they do, you they mislead your child. Now this kind mothers go tell their picking say, oh yeah, oh yeah, draw up you are not going to school again. Go and do your work, mom. I don't know how to do. It. You go and learn it. They learn everything. These are the kind of mother that encourages their children to go and carry gun, rob, you know, do all sort of evil things. Waiting the day after now, money, money, money. You are not after the future of your child. Is that not what you're saying? Is that not what you're saying? You're angry. I saw the younger brother too. So that one was, I think he was taking a drug or something. He has colored on his tongue. One little boy like that snap with this same guy. Mother, you are misleading your children. I need to tell you this. Like seriously, I want every other responsible mother to come outside and talk to this woman. Senses that what she is doing is wrong, wrong, wrong. This little boy, we say, in suppose this school, you suppose push and go, go and fix your studies, go and fix your study. At first, the boy first bleach from A to Z, see knock all over, all, all over his hand. Imagine I visited his page. He's doing nothing there. They do like mumu for him page. Madam, why not direct him right? As in, give him something as in kind of knowledge that will help him help him his future, rather than all this encouraging your son to go and draw somebody else's face on his body. Not even your family. No, not even your own picture. Neither did that this picture. Madam, this is very, very wrong. Very, very wrong. At the end of it, now the picking go grow, it will become somebody, so something else. We be just saying, you know, go even they are of value to you, the mother, because you mislead them from child. Imagine, ah, so and deep, the poverty never reached this extent at all. It's just like you lost your senses. The poverty never reached like this. Guys, so me. Got casted on Instagram. So I actually invited him down here because I noticed he had a tattoo of my face. And trust me, this is it's too much. So we have one more person. Come, come, two more person. Okay, so meet Fumzi Porch on Instagram. Fumzi Porch. Yeah, so, I have a okay. tattoo. She has my my name. Bob Risky. 
Okay, so me, the last person. I'm going to pass them on Instagram. So, um, they, are, they are with me, they're in my house. Um, I want to appreciate them. Give them thanks for coming. We are still having a dinner on Saturday. Thank you. On this closed location. Thank you. So, I'll give them enough. But this is just... Let's go through some comments. This one says, when I see that background, I don't know, say something is not right. Money go cost for this life and eh? money power save no go carry am on God. Someone in this comment section will make 10 million naira before the year end. Mm. Poverty. Mm? God will punish those looting our common wealth. Amen to that prayer. I have never felt this embarrassed on someone's behalf. When shameless mixed with poverty, Ogbenuta. <laughs> May God heal our land. Amen, oh my brother. I'm super proud of my parents. Me too, oh I'm proud. I am grateful for the life and parents that I have. Same here. Another smartphone in wrong hands. I don't understand that too. <laughs> this is so embarrassing. <laughs> Same thing I feel. Or more poverty and ignorance. You know go better for you. <laughs> Poverty in a bastard. Oh, a tattoo don't they trend past COVID-19 for Lagos? Now, true. Imagine. Because of Sable Risky, don't give the other lady one million naira and some uh, endorsement. Every other one of them, can they copy that same lady, they draw tattoo, they draw Bob Risky face like Sable Risky now. Somebody important, somebody responsible. She is an, he is an irresponsible person. So, hey, may God help us in Nigeria. Another new one. The Awusas, the that's the Awusa full and me, you know they are um major ones that provide us food in Nigeria like um, onions, tomato and the rest. Now they said they are not supplying Nigerians their product again. They prefer taking it to neighboring country to go and supply them. Hey, she on gonna go kill us like this. In fact, me I'm advising every one of us to start farming as in the little things you can do, like tomatoes pepe and the rest start doing it now make hunger no kill us for nigeria aboki don't face they don't want to supply us food nigerians why you are they like this eh around november october december people were complaining up and down even comedians were doing skits up and down but ever since things turned around has anyone come out to say we are grateful lord for providing for us no one has done that but I'll be the only person to do it. Lord, I am grateful. Look at it. Now I can swim in the basket of onions. Just look at this, guys. It's got God merciful and wonderful. <laughs> guys, let's learn how to be appreciative. The same way Jesus healed 10 people. It was only one person that came to say thank you. Now I have come to confess. We have plenty of onions. We can chop as many as we want. <laughs> Oh, guys, learn how to be appreciative. That's all I have to say. Love is a must, but relationship is by choice. Tell your neighbor, neighbor, I love you, but that doesn't mean I have to make you my friend. Hey! Anybody that is not making you better, that is making you bitter, let them go. You are the CEO of your life. You have the right to invite, delete, and terminate. Even on Facebook, it's not everybody that you have to accept their request. Hey, some people you must delete. Hey guys, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. And quick reminder, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share with friends. Thank you so much. I love you. Bye-bye.